hey everyone i'm back with another video if you haven't done so already please subscribe to my channel i know i don't really post that much content but i'm trying my best like my videos and please comment below you know i love the opinions of others but i want to get into this review on baddies east really quick the fight between scotty and anna honestly it's not even worth judging i don't think anybody won they're not fighters um a lot of hair pulling Security gets in the way. It's just a waste of time. They don't even get to fight for so, for too long. It's hard to tell who wins these fights, but in my opinion, I don't think anybody won. Anna reminds me of Money from the Academy and um, Big Lex Body Collection. I feel like they have the same type of energy, the same voice, the same actions, everything. Let me know what you think, but I think she 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 reminds me of money, to be honest. But I just feel like these girls need to really stop with the fighting and try to get down to the bottom of the issue or the root of the issue. Before the show came out, I saw you know this back and forth between Scotty and Anna online. I think that could have been resolved. It's so stupid at this point. They're both beautiful women, you know. People say that Anna's ugly. I don't think she's ugly. I think she's cute. I think Scotty's cute. Um, T was saying that you know. Scotty's gap teeth spread it bigger than it was but I think Scotty looks cute with the little gap teeth I think she's too cute to be fighting and you know like I said before in previous videos a lot you know words get to us and yes we're angered by them very quickly I want to fight but I feel like there's so much more out there that can anger people I don't think these little petty internet beefs are worth it you know what I mean I know people have a lot to say and people talk and can't back it up and people want to prove themselves but i think it's just dumb so honestly i don't think anybody won that fight between you know scotty and anna nobody won then we're gonna get into mariah lynn and um i forgot i think her name's smiley i agree with um mariah 100 percent. obviously if that was my sister i definitely would have you know ran up every time i saw her at the audition she tried to fight her for whatever reason to prove she's bad she got on the show okay but like yeah if it's my sibling i'm not gonna let that shit slide either so i'm with mariah 100 percent. and then we're gonna get into natalie and camilla i feel like natalie should be behind the scenes i don't think she should be on screen fighting i think she should put on her ep hat and honestly be a bigger boss and be more mature sit down with Camila and talk with her. This beef was years ago. I don't think there was any reason for Natalie to run up on her like that. Camila, I felt bad for her because she looked like she wanted to embrace Natalie and maybe try to talk the issue out, but Natalie wasn't having it. I respect Natalie for what she's doing, but that running up on, on Camila, that was just, and she didn't even do much. People are saying she won and all this. Honestly, I felt really bad for Camila. I think she's better than this show, but obviously I feel like her being on the show is going to bring her more of a fan base. She's gonna get a lot more fans and more exposure, but I actually think that Camila should be, you know, should be doing way better than this show. She just had a baby, she has three kids, she has her nice husband, you know, but I get it. A lot of the fans want to see her on the show, and of course, Natalie would put her on the show so that she could try to embarrass her, because that's what I think it was. <clears throat> I think Natalie wanted to try and embarrass Camila, but um, Natalie lost points from me because her that the way she came in was just it was just sickening. I don't like how she threw that drink on Camila. Camila was not ready or prepared for that and natalie that was her way of trying to conquer that fight but she didn't do much either she pretty much still got laid out she forgot who camila was camila's a baddie she's an og just like her natalie's too quick to be talking about girls are broke and she's this and she's that okay i get it i get it i give nelly her flowers because she you know she is doing her big one she she has her show but without the ceo himself lamel Plummer, who owns zeus i don't think nelly would have her own um streaming platform to put her show on so i think nelly should humble herself and actually be thanking lamel for that you know um these girls can get exposure without her, I feel. I feel like Natalie, you know, wants to believe that all these girls are being put on because or are bigger than they are because of her. But I think these girls could find their own way without Natalie, to be honest. That's just my opinion. And this scene where 
she's hugging it out after all of that after pretty much losing and not achieving anything and trying to fight camila this is what she should have done in the beginning i feel like she should have sat down with camila she didn't have to go and embrace her and hug her or anything but she could have sat down with her and talked about the five-year-old six-year-old beef that they had before you know trying to fight camila and pretty much failing at it you know camila really didn't look like she wanted to fight but i'm glad that regardless of what they did come together or natalie did throw all of that away after she discovered that she went nowhere with that fight sat down with her and tried to you know make amends with her after telling her pretty much it's her shit and she's broken this and that and then at the end saying they could get money together blah 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 all of that should have been from scratch you know i think natalie went about it the wrong way and that's why i say she should be behind the scenes and give these let these other girls just do their thing on the show you know natalie's been on the show four seasons as an ep but yet still fighting and like she's obviously the creator of all the drama but i just i just feel like she should take a back seat you know make more money behind the scenes and let these girls do what they have to do you know she is smart she's a genius for the idea of baddies i'll give her that but yeah she i don't think she should be on the show after this season i think she should just sit behind and let these girls make the money but i'm glad to see you know i was glad to see roly i was glad to see sky um t she is a character um a lot of people say she's annoying mm, she kind of brings humor to the show in my opinion um well vicky don't think she belongs here at all i'm all for jesus i'm a believer of the creator but if you believe so much in god you should not be on the show i'm sorry um she just doesn't fit she's too humble she's too quiet she looks scary um Krishan, she's pregnant don't know why she's on the show um should just let her sister do her thing Krishan is putting herself in harm's way like you see in the next episode she starts throwing stuff at natalie and stuff like that like i'm sorry i don't think the baby should be hearing all that ruckus in her stomach um that's all i got though i will be bringing a review for the next episode and i did enjoy the episode I didn't want to review episode one. I'm sorry. It was just too much, you know, introducing the girls and this and that. I get it. I know who most of the girls were. Um, I definitely agree with Scotty when she said that, you know, Natalie, that's, you know, the Krishan and sister beef was not her place. But I do understand where Natalie was coming from. She was defending Krishan, but she has to forget families over everything. And, you know, once you have beef with her sister... She didn't have beef with you, regardless of the good that you were trying to do. So, but like I said, I do like what Natalie did. She did try to stick up for Krishan, but it backfired. So, I think she learned her lesson in not sticking her nose where it doesn't belong. But I, this is all I have for this episode. So, let me know what you guys thought. You know, maybe you guys have a different opinion. Maybe you guys disagree, but I would love to hear what you guys have to say. And again, please like and subscribe to my channel. I will be doing more videos and I will try to get out as much content as possible. It is hard. I am busy, but I will do my best. And again, thanks for the love, the support. Um, the subscribers are going up and I appreciate it. I really, really appreciate it. So again let me know what you think comment below like comment and subscribe and i will see you in the next video until then stay blessed